Hey guys, Dr. Brandy Manny, developer of the Functional Practice. Uh, quick video today about the labs I use for testing patients. Uh, before we get into it, make sure if you're watching this on YouTube, make sure you subscribe, right? Make sure you ring that bell so that you're notified each time I make a new video, okay? Um, let me start with a rant, okay? Because I talked to Doc a couple, a couple days ago and he went to a conference, right? He went to big functional medicine seminar, conference, whatever, whole weekend deal. The, the doctor on stage, right? well-known functional guy highly respected um, chiropractor right good good guy good dude good dude he said to everybody's there he said you the doctor needs to spend at least twenty five hundred dollars on lab work on that first visit twenty at least twenty five hundred dollars on lab. that's doctor's cost that's not anything about what you charge the patient what you profit twenty five twenty five hundred dollars I'm like not true <laughs> not true. And not only that, it drives me nuts because for a long time, I've been rolling with the system of sensitivities, deficiencies, and toxicities. Like if you can fix these three pillars, that's a damn good starting point. You're going to help eight out of 10 sick people get well, maybe even nine out of 10. No, I'm not saying nutrients and uh, toxins and, and food, food sensitivity. I'm not saying that's the end all be all, but it's a damn good starting point. Don't overwhelm them. Could you imagine your day one, twenty five hundred dollars? Like, like, hey, what are you gonna charge the patient? Oh, hey, hey, Mary, five grand, first visit before I even meet you, five thousand. A tough nut to crack. B, how many people are gonna, how many no's are you gonna get before you get a yes? Right? Does that even make sense? You're doing thyroid stuff. You're doing a gut stuff that they might not even need all that stuff. So you're providing overwhelm for that patient. What does your day two look like? <laughs> My day two, 25, 30 minutes. Your day two is gonna be three hours long because you gotta turn $2,500 worth of tests. Is that, so is that realistic? So anyway, two weeks ago I had a call with a patient, uh, thyroid came from YouTube and uh, medical doctor, TSH, T3, T4, right? So no thyroid antibodies. This is what I use for thyroid. Okay, so let me just get into the labs I use. ZRT labs. This is they do thyroid testing through quick finger prick, which means you can keep it on keep it in house, keep it under one roof. Uh, again, no nurse needed, no phlebotomist needed. That's how our food testing is as well. But you can send a test kit in the mail. So I sent her a test kit. She's testing herself, and we're gonna determine: Hey, is this Hashimoto's? Right? Is it autoimmune thyroid, or is it really a problem with the thyroid? So ZRT labs. I'll put a link in the description so you can uh, take a look at that. I'm not going to talk about pricing either in this video because this is going to be on YouTube and for the protection of this lab and the protection of doctors using it, I'm not going to go over price or math, but just understand, no, nowhere near $2,500. Um, so that's, that's what I use for thyroid and they test, th they test adrenals, they look at other, they look at cardio biomarkers as well. So for a long time for weight loss, we were doing like a before cardio biomarker, HDL, LDL, uh, cholesterol. And then we would do a post. So I put them on a 12 week program, my trial system, and then we retest to make sure. So I tell that patient, we are functionally better. All right. So here's my protocol. And, and for a lot of years, I've been using this system of sensitivities, deficiencies, toxicities. I know if I can fix these three pillars, I'm going to help a lot of sick people get well. And it's nowhere near $2,500. Uh, and it works a lot, like 90% of the time. Foods, right? Food sensitivity testing. Quick test, easy test, done under one roof. No nurse needed, no phlebotomist needed, no outside lab needed for a blood draw. Keep the testing in-house. As long as you have a flat surface, a table, a desk, you can start testing patients. It's easy, it's convenient, it's affordable for patients. Okay, we test everybody. Um, and it's called Food Align, and I'll put a link in the description beneath this video if you wanna go create an account. Um, you, we have a practitioner portal where you can go watch the videos, the trainings, you can grab some marketing materials like PDFs and handouts and sample reports that you can laminate and show patients. Um, so get you up to speed on the clinical side. If you want help marketing anything, we can help you market this stuff as well. So sensitivities, deficiencies, that's the hair lab, right? Pull some hair. So I do a common question that doctors have is because the hair lab also does food sensitivity testing through hair analysis. I use blood. I, I'm more comfortable with the blood, I'm the finger prick, been doing it for 13 years. I'm gonna stick with that. Um, I use hair lab, right, hair analysis for nutrient deficiencies. The cool thing about that is that, you know, lab will give you, okay, you're deficient in these 10 things or these seven things or these five things. So then you can go supplement, hey, I'm Mary, I'm gonna put you on calcium, um, B12 and glutathione or whatever it might be. 
okay, you put them on the deficiencies, but then you can also say, hey, go eat more of these foods because the lab gives you a printout of all the foods that that patient, uh, okay, that the foods that are abundant in that specific nutrient that that patient is deficient in. Right? Does, does that make any sense? So patient is deficient in glutathione, lab will get, hey, well, lab will say, hey, go eat more broccoli, go eat more cabbage or cauliflower, whatever it is, whatever is abundant in glutathione, Whatever foods glutathione is abundant in, right? It'll say, go eat more of those foods. So you can supplement or say, hey, go eat more foods. That's how we use the deficiency testing. And then we also, the, the hair lab also looks at heavy metals. So, and you can determine, hey, do I want to do a heavy metal cleanse or detox, something like that. In which case I use systemic formulas for that. Prep phase, body phase, brain phase, tie in cyto detox, on months, two months, three, All right? sensitivities, deficiencies, toxicities. If you can deflame them, if you can reduce inflammation, right? If you can fix their gut, if you can um, just cl clean up their lifestyle, right? Remove toxins out of their kitchen, remove toxins out of their fridge. By toxins, I mean high fructose corn syrup, preservatives, nitrates, MSG, trans fats, collars, dyes, aspartame. If you can clean up their lifestyle, you're gonna get sick patients well. You do not have to spend $2,500 on that first visit with the patient for you. Now, what are you gonna charge patient? That, that's, that's the bigger thing. It's like, you're gonna, you're gonna run into 10 patients and you're gonna get nine no's. I've been there and <laughs> I'm, do, I'm doing this stuff. So for somebody who's on stage and he's like preaching to the masses, hey, you gotta charge, blah, blah, blah. Hmm. Is that, is that reality? That's the, that's the question, is that reality? Yes, there are functional, because I've had patients come to me and I'm their sixth, seventh, eighth doctor they've been to, they've been to all these functional medicine doctors, they do all this, this lab work on the first visit, $3,000 worth of testing on that first visit, and they're still not better, and they still find me, <laughs> and I'm still, hey, let's food test, let's deflame, let's detoxify, let's, let's do a prep body brain phase, let's, clean, let's detoxify and deflame the cells at the cell level. See what I'm saying? It works, it works very, very well, and you don't have to overwhelm that patient. So, all right guys, I'm on a rant. Hopefully this training was helpful, but again, ZRT, use that for thyroid. Um, and then for, we have food line, food line, quick finger prick, food testing, and um, that, that's got a fast turnaround time. It's, it's automated pipetting, so, so it's, it's a lot more affordable than any other lab out there. And we've negotiated, because we, we do so much volume, we've negotiated the price point way down. So it's very, very affordable for doctors, doesn't touch the 2,500, not even close. Uh, and then again, I'm not gonna get into math. Just log in, just create an account, log into the portals, that's where the math will be explained. So, um, and then we do the hair analysis, right? Sensitivities, deficiencies, and toxicities works very, very well. And uh, if you have any questions, as always, throw them in the comment section beneath this video. And, but like I said too, I'll, I'll get you the, the specific links if you wanna gain, gain access to our food lab, our hair analysis lab, and then also the ZRT. I'll put those links in the description beneath this video. So, all right guys, hopefully this training was helpful. If you have any questions, let me know. See you next time.